Deep in the bowels of an old power plant, a sinister plot is hatching. Ha ha! At last the time has come to hatch my sinister plot! This lever will activate my blackout generator and the world will be thrown into eternal night! Not so fast, darkness! What? <gasps> Pajama Man! That's right, fiend! And I have some gadgets of my own! Take that! Ah! Not the Illuminator Mark V! Do you have anything to say before you're sucked into my portable bad guy containment unit? I wish you'd pick up your socks once in a while. Sure thing, Mom. You can consider that done. Okay, Sam. You remember tonight's the night we go to sleep with the lights off. Don't worry about me, Mom. I'm ready. And I can put on my pajama Sam mask if I get scared. That's good, dear. Good night, Sam. Good night, Mom. There's no need to hide when it's dark outside. No need to hide when it's dark outside. I'm not scared. Darkness lives in my closet, but that's okay. I'm not scared. Okay, I'm scared. I can't sleep with darkness hanging around in my closet. I'm gonna have to capture him. This is a job for... Pajama Sam! Now where's my Pajama Sam mask? I need that and my flashlight and my lunchbox. I'm sure that my stuff's in here somewhere. I need to find my Pajama Sam stuff so I can go into my closet and capture darkness! Oopsie! I can't go get mom and dad. I have to handle this by myself. I can't go get mom and dad. I have to handle this by myself. And introducing Randall. said I should pick these up. This is where I'll put all the socks I find. my pajama Sam mask right where it's supposed to be. How did that happen? Now I just need my lunchbox and my flashlight. That's Pajama Man. He's my hero. Nothing under here. Nothing good under there. Here's my flashlight underneath all my socks. The 
the Illuminator Mark V Jr. It takes 2D batteries, you know. Now I just have to find my lunchbox. Darkness is in my closet, but I still need to find my lunchbox before I can go after him. Hey, my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox. Who threw this away? I can keep darkness in here after I capture him. Okay, I'm ready to go into my closet and capture darkness. All right, I'm ready for action. All right, darkness, here comes Pajama Sam. Hello? Is anybody in here? Darkness? Hello? Wow, this looks like where darkness lives, all right. I better go find it before Mom notices I'm gone. Well, there's no turning back now. As soon as I capture darkness, I won't be afraid to sleep with the lights out anymore. Boy, I had no idea my closet was this big on the inside. Another sock. I better pick it up like Mom said. I should match up these socks. Looks like I need to find a total of 10 pairs of socks. Hey, a board. It's too far to reach. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Before entering the land of darkness, young man! Declare? Well, no, I guess not. I, um... I think we'd better confiscate these items. They could be dangerous. Hey, I need those! And you're traveling in disguise. Let's see what you really look like, hmm? My Pajama Sam mask! Pajama Sam, eh? Well, all right then, Pajama Sam. You can go, but I've got my eye on you. 
<laughs> Uh-oh. Now what do I do? I can't get over there. I'm tied to a tree. I wonder what Pajama Man would do in a situation like this. You can borrow that if you like. Uh, thanks. I feel bad about you losing your things. Yeah, how am I supposed to capture darkness without all my stuff? Well, I'm sure your things are here in the land of darkness somewhere. If you look around, you might be able to find them again. I hope so. I'll bring you back your rope later, okay? Good luck. Hi, how you doing? Pretty good. How about you? I can't complain. That's good. It's against the rules. Oh. Hello, Sam. What's new? Hi, Tree. You know, I really enjoy a nice piece of cheese now and again. Cheese is awfully tasty. Indeed. But I'm lactose intolerant. Oh. Hi, how you doing? Pretty good. How about you? I can't complain. That's good. It's against the rules. Oh. That scary looking place up there must be Darkness's house. I'll bet that's where I'll find him. That looks like Darkness's house. That looks like Darkness's house. It says Dark's house. It says Boat Dock. It says Mines. Pajama Sam. I'm gonna capture darkness and put him in a lunchbox. That's great. My name's Mud. Really? No, not really. Then why did you say it is? <sighs> Look, I I'm sorry, kid. I'm just real depressed is all. See, I, I used to roll all over the place on this here track. Up, down, sideways, loop to loop, but the fun I had. But then I got rushed. Rust? Yeah. Rust! See, my wheels are rusted stiff, so I'm stuck right here on this spot. Can't move at all. Gee, that's too bad. Yeah, especially in summer when the pigeons come down here for some shade. Another sock! What do you know, another sock? Hi, my name's Sam. I'm here to capture darkness. Pleased to meet you, Sam. You can call me Atto. Would you give me a ride across the river? Oh, no. I can't go in the water, I'd sink. I'm made of wood, you know. But wood floats. No, I don't think so. I had this friend and he told me this story about his dentist brother who, um, he was made of wood and he got in the water and he sank. Really? Straight to the bottom. It's so scary. I wish I'd been a car. I think your friend was wrong. Wood floats in the water. Oh, I wish that were true. Oh, 
Nice tree's not too mad that I lost a rope. At least I got this great piece of wood. Miss Tree, um, I'm sorry, but I, uh, I lost the rope you let me borrow. Rope? Oh, that's all right. I can probably get a new one. You're not mad? Nah, actually, it's kind of a relief not to have to hold that rope up all day long. I need to find my stuff before I go get darkness. Okay, check this out. It's wood, right? Yes. All right, now watch. See, it floats. Wood floats. Yeah? So you'll float too. Go on, give it a try. I guess. Well, so far, so good. Well, here goes nothing. I'm doing it. I'm floating. Yahoo! Oh, boy, this is great. Can I give you a ride somewhere? Come on, hop in. Let's go sailing! Well, technically we can't do that since I'm not a sailboat because I don't have a sail. I know what you mean, but technically you should say, let's go floating or something like that. Sure, sure, whatever you say. Let's go sailing! Okay. Do you like my chin? A what? A geyser. It's kind of a hot spring that spurts up water and steam every so often. It works kind of like a coffee percolator. Water in passages deep down where the rocks are hot gets heated up to the point where it would normally turn into steam. Except it doesn't because of the pressure of all the other water on top of it. So it gets really hot and it expands and it pushes some of the colder water out of the top. That relieves the pressure and all of a sudden, the hot water turns into steam and POW! It erupts out, along with all the colder water on top. Then more water flows down into the deep passages and the whole thing starts all over again. Most geysers are located in Wyoming, New Zealand, or Iceland. The word geyser originated in Iceland, from their word geosa, meaning gush. Geysers are usually very unpredictable about when they erupt. The most famous exception is a geyser called Old Faithful in Yellowstone National Park in Wyoming, which erupts every 64 minutes. Uh, give or take about three minutes. It looks like this one goes off a lot more often than that. Um, thanks a lot, Otto. That looks like one of Dad's socks. I wonder how it got here. Wait a 
like it. Bye, Otto. I'll be back soon. Okay, I'll leave the meter running. Huh? Well, um, I had this friend, and he's a taxi, and... Okay, bye bye now. Bye bye <laughs> Another sock. My name's Sam. How nice. Do you guys know Otto the boat? Oh, I should say not. I'm going to capture darkness and put him in my lunchbox. Yes, well, why don't you run along and play then? We have important tree business to discuss. Hold! Just where do you think you are going? Um, nowhere really. I just wanted to pass by. Just barging through like that? Without even asking permission? Have you no manners? It is customary. Oh no, this isn't another customs inspection, is it? Are you gonna take all my stuff? I assure you, we have no interest in your stuff. Phew, that's a relief. I'm sorry if I offended you. May I pass through? No. No? This is an exclusive road. It's for trees only. Yes, trees only. Now, be off with you. I can't capture darkness until I find all my pajama sand stuff. I need to find my stuff before I go get darkness. Neat! An old hollow log! Maybe there's a frog in it or something. Rats! There's nothing in here at all. Uh-oh! Oh, I think I'm stuck! Yes, I'm definitely stuck. I wonder how Pajama Man would handle this. Whoa! Whoa! Ow! Good day, fellow tree. And a good day to you as well. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Whew, it's hot in there. Hey, that's my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox over there. I got another sock. can't get to it through all these plants with big thorns on them. I wish I had super tough skin like Pajama Man. Is that my Pajama Sam mask? This mask belongs to the people. It sure looks like my mask. Property is theft, man. Anyway, I need the mask to protect my identity as the leader of the Salad Liberation Front. The what? The Salad Liberation Front. We're a group of veggies fighting against the core system. We're tired of being relegated to the salad. We want to be the main course. Whatever. I just want my mask back. I'll tell you what. The other carrots are being held prisoner in the refrigerator in Darkness's kitchen. If you help me free the carrots, I'll give you back the mask. Okay, it's a deal. Great. I'll come with you to the kitchen so I can direct the operation. Okay, sure. I guess I better put my ingenious disguise back on. Whoa! Good day, fellow tree. And a good day to you as well. Thank <laughs> you. 
Phew, it's hot in there. That looks like one of my big brother Mark's socks. Smells like one too. I sure could use a cheese sandwich right about now. It's an oil can. And there's some oil in it. I can't open this door, there's no knob on it. Let's go back up the falls and come down again. Oh, I have a better idea. Let's not. Anyway, we can't go back up those falls. We'll have to go out a different way. bucket from that well in the sticker bushes. The current is too strong. I can't get this up there by myself. I got another sock! Um, how about not right away, okay? Here, I think maybe this might help your wheels. Hey, that's good. Now do the back, huh? Ooh, ooh, yeah! Yahoo! Fun yeah! I'm king of the tracks again, thanks to you, kid. Hey, what'd you say your name was? Sam. Well, listen, Sam, the king owes you big time. Anytime you need a ride through the mines, a king will take you. As soon as I capture darkness, I won't be afraid to sleep with the lights out anymore. What's this thing? Well, that's a water meter. It says 491. <laughs> what 
are you going to do with that? You'll see. Okay, you be careful with it, yeah? By the way, what is this thing? It's a pickaxe for mining gold. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Don't even bother, kid. It's a one-way door. It says gold. There must be gold through there. is a remote mining terminal. Try it out. It's fun. Looks like a game to me. You're supposed to pick up the nuggets without crashing into anything, including yourself. Watch out for the moving rocks and hot lava.
on a sock back there. Gold. Sure is. I can't get it out of there. You're gonna have to find something to mine it with. I'm pretty sure that won't work. I warned you to be careful. Yeah, but look at all this gold I got. Since you're fabulously rich, uh, how about sharing the wealth a little? Say, let me have the small piece, huh? Deal. Anytime you need a ride through the mines, a king will take you. Cross the bridge to see what's on the other side. Don't try to butter me up. If you want to go across, you'll have to pay a toll. How much is the toll? One pound of gold. Here you go. This should be at least a pound. All right, you're clear. Go on across. Havarti! I'm fine, how are you? No, 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 I said Havarti! Don't you know how to play cheese and crackers? Mom told me I shouldn't play with my food. No, cheese and crackers is the name of a game, see? Come on, I'll show you how to play. Hey, this is like tic-tac-toe! Tic-tac-who? No, no, this is cheese and crackers. Pay attention! First, you need to choose which you're gonna be, the cheese or the crackers. The cheese, of course! Okay, I'll be the crackers. You're trying to get three of your cheeses in a row before I get three crackers in a row. I'll go first. Now, you move. I already have a piece there. What are you waiting for? Now it's my turn. I won! Now can I eat the cheese? No. What did that word mean that you said before? Avarti? That's what you say mm. when you want to play cheese and crackers with someone. And then if they want to play too, they say provolone back to you. Oh, I get it. Havarti. Provolone. Try to get three in a row. Can I eat the cheese when we're done playing? Sorry, kid. The cheese stays here in the park. You go first. Now it's my turn. Now you move. Now it's my turn. Gouda, move! Now you move. I won! Now can I eat the cheese? No. Havarti. Provolone! Try to get four in a row. Can I eat the cheese when we're done playing? Sorry, kid. The cheese stays here in the park. I'll go first. Now you move. Now you move. Where's 
should I move? I won! Now can I eat the cheese? No. Havarti. Provolone. Try to get five in a row. Can I eat the cheese when we're done playing? Sorry, kid. The cheese stays here in the park. I'll go first. Now you move. Where should I move? Now you move. Whoa, you're as sharp as sharp cheddar. Now it's my turn. I won! Now can I eat the cheese? No. Hold it! If you're planning on coming back, I'll have to stamp your hand. Oh, okay. You wouldn't believe how many people try to cheat me. Thanks. This is Darkness's house, all right. I got a fuck! There's no mail, beat it. Well, all right, there's a little mail, but it's all for Darkness, and it's all bills. You don't want what's in here, trust me. Now, oh, all right, here you go. Darkness may already have won a fabulous million dollar prize. Yeah, right. I don't think I can climb up there. These baskets must be the way up into Darkness's house. These are pretty heavy. Oh. I guess I weigh more than one stone. Hello? Anybody home? <laughs> I'm nobody's doormat. Who?
I can't let you in, but you might liberate the carrots that I'm holding for the huge green salad. Darkness is just, is just the waste. He drinks so much, you'd think he'd burst. My job is a daily grind. I've got mincing on my mind. Chopping up my plate and then these vegetables of julienne. To cut, slice, mince, and slash. A job to run without much cash. This is one of those dumbwaiter things. I bet I could fit in there. That's a no no, we avow it. No, we simply can't allow it. I've got digging down to a science I'm the biggest household of lions Please, won't you open the door since I have another victim? What? I surrender, not ever await Now I see you now have captured that troublesome carrot feeder guy. I'll open up my door so you can put that rogue inside my drawer. Oh no, our orange leader was caught. Our fight for our freedom for not we are diminished. Completely finished carrot. Hey guys. Don't you see, he's with me, and you're free to go. Free! Yes, free! 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 I almost forgot this, but you've earned it. You have taken the tide and turned it. You may take this mask and wear it. A gift of gratitude from this carrot. Hooray, I finally have my mask. Two more things and I finish my task. Going down. I should turn on the music again. Well, I guess that's not gonna work. Why aren't you moving anymore? Hello? Woo! I saw you dancing. But a boom, but boom, but a boom, but a boom, but a boom. Just pretend you can't see me and start dancing again. All right, he's gone. Hi. Hello, and welcome to the Brain Tickler, the game where you get to show how smart you really are. Actually, I just wanted to go through. 
I think we can arrange that, can't we, Wink? That's right, Blink. But you'll have to answer a few questions first, because as you know, no one can pass through the doors of knowledge without first playing the, the Brain Tickler. Let's meet our first contestant. What's your name, son? Uh, it's Sam. He's Sam, all the way from, well, wherever it is he's from. His interests include skydiving, channeling ancient spirits, and stamp collecting. I don't collect stamps. You're making that up. And he'll be playing today for the right to pass through the doors of knowledge. He'll be asked questions from four categories. Once he's correctly answered one question from each of the categories, he wins. And we all know what that means, right, Wink? Step right over here, Sam, and select your first category. Our categories today are geography, entomology, art, and the land of darkness. I'll take the land of darkness. All right, here is your question. What is the reading on the water meter located in the mines near Darkness's house? 491. That's absolutely right. You've done your homework. That's one category down and three to go. You're doing well. Go ahead and choose another category. Let me try entomology. All right, here is your question. How many legs does a centipede have? 100. That's correct. Centi is a prefix meaning 100, although in reality, a centipede can have anywhere from 30 to more than 300 legs. Two down, two to go. All right, which of the remaining two categories would you like to try next? I'll take geography, please. All right, here is your question. In which ocean are the islands of Hawaii located? The Pacific Ocean. That's correct. Jeez. You're really on a roll now. Are you ready for your final category? Um, uh, uh, I'll try art. All right, here is your question. Who painted the Mona Lisa? Leonardo da Vinci. Correct! This Italian artist painted the Mona Lisa in the early 1500s. You correctly answered questions from all four categories. That makes you the new Brain Tickler Grand Champion! Congratulations, Sam! Gee, thanks! Dom Perignon, tell us what he's won! Blink, as the new Grand Champion, Sam has won the right to pass through the doors of knowledge anytime he chooses. Isn't that fantastic? You mean I could go through right now if I want to? That's right! Wow! Thank you for being here with us on The Brain Tickler! Until next time, this is Wink! And Blink! Saying good night! Wink and Blink's wardrobe was provided by the One Coat Paint Company. I wonder where those trees hid my pajama Sam gear. <laughs> The doorknob came off. I didn't do it. I barely touched it. Pardon? Excuse me. Pardon me. Sorry. <laughs> well, well, well. We don't get many visitors around here. How do you do? Pretty well, thanks. How about all of you? We're fine. 
Thank you for asking. I'm not. In fact, I'm downright downbeat. Oh? How come? Because I ain't got nobody. <laughs> hey, oars! It's no use, I can't reach them. I bet Otto could use those. Nice view from up here. You be careful now. Even nicer view from up here. Be careful now, you, you might break something. I think I need to swing higher. Did not tell you to be careful. I bet Otto would like these. <laughs> hey, hey, check this out. This ship on me is not by me. I'd never ride such travesty. This is depraved, this is depraved. Beethoven's rolling in his grave. <laughs> well, well, well. Have you ever tired? A mango or a pineapple or peach Maybe you should mumble with a manatee in the casket <laughs> What do you know, another sock? I don't believe I can eat that cheese, Sam. What did one eye say to the other eye? There's something in between that smells. Hey, one of my socks! Beware the jub jub bird and shun the frumious bandersnatch. What on earth is this? The Book of Clues. If you are a clever fellow, try to push in only yellow. Whoa, that looks like a secret door. I don't see any way to open it. I think that did the trick. Well, here we are, burning. I feel lightheaded. You're burning up, Wax for Brains. We all are. I wonder what this button does. Look at that, would ya? <laughs> wow, this is like a secret mad scientist lab or something. <laughs> what do you know, another sock? I float and I think and I think and I think about walking or driving a car or riding a bike and I think and I float because I'm just a brain in a jar. Senior Scarlet in the basement with the ten penny nail.
weather control. Mixing yellow, green, and red makes a rain cloud for your head. Disguise. Mix up purple, red, and green to impersonate the queen. Off with his head! Voice of power. He who wants the loudest purple, mix up yellow, green, and purple. Excuse me. Marshmallow. The recipe for good marshmallow uses purple, red, and yellow. Mmm, that's a good marshmallow. Invisibility. If you wish to hide from view, mix up purple, green, and blue. Mouse call. Mixing purple, red, and orange makes you squeak just like a door hinge. Hey, I like cheese too! Super brain. If you would be a clever fellow, mix up orange, green, and yellow. <laughs> I've become staggeringly intelligent. All the world's knowledge is mine. I can do anything. Except lift my enormous head off the counter. Fireball, purple, orange, and finally green is the recipe for acetylene. Excuse me. Music, ability to play the cello is found in orange, red, and yellow. Air. Something good to eat with bread is made with orange, green, and red. <laughs> Hair growth. Mixing purple, orange, and brown puts curly locks upon your crown. Ultra hearing. Mix up brown with yellow and red and you will hear the spider's tread. <laughs> Wisdom. To meet the wisest man in town, use purple mixed with green and brown. The wisest man is he who understands that he understands nothing. But how can he understand if he understands nothing? Ah! You begin to understand! <laughs> Anti-gravity. When mixing orange, green, and brown, all the world turns upside down. Off. 
fame. If you would achieve renown, try purple, yellow, and some brown. I'm on TV! <laughs> hey, let me out! There's nothing to do in here. Wealth, if poverty is what you dread, mix some brown with green and red. Wow, I'm rich! <laughs> Internal Revenue Service, I'm gonna have to take some of that for taxes. You can keep this moldy piece of cheese. Invisibility. If you wish to hide from view, mix up purple, green, and blue. Wow! I'm invisible! This must be one of those dumb waiter things that's like a little elevator for food. I bet I could ride this one right back up to the kitchen. This must go back up to the kitchen. Visible. Knob should fit the door. Once again, Pajama Sam saves the day with his mighty brain. These hinges look kind of rusty. I better oil them. That did the trick. My flashlight! Now I just have to get my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox and I'll be all set. Okay, darkness, watch out! Maybe these will help with the strong current in that street. Yeah. I bet they will. Thanks. Otto, do you think you could get us over by the bucket now? Yeah. Box. 
Why call it that when you can't eat it? I beg your pardon? Well, it seems very silly to call it a lunchbox when you wouldn't dream of having it for lunch. But your lunch goes in it. Your lunch goes in you, does it not? Perhaps you would like me to call you lunchbox as well. I'm not a box. Ah, too true. Watch out, darkness! Here comes Pajama Sam! My name's Sam. You can call me Fingelbert Brayfelglop. Where'd you get a name like that? I didn't say it was my name. I just said you could call me that, if you want to. Oh, uh, thanks. I'm gonna put on my Pajama Sam mask, capture darkness with my flashlight, and keep him in my lunchbox. There's another thing. What? Flashlight! It doesn't actually flash, does it? I mean, not by itself. You're really a pain, you know that? Nonsense! I'm a wishing well! Of course. Hey, pennies! I wish... I wish the grass were greener here. Why are you wishing? I threw the penny in. Who's the wishing well here, you or me? Oh. I wish for a penny. Oh, good heavens, I've got my wish already, haven't I? Thank you. I wish for a giant chicken sandwich with spicy mustard and Swiss cheese. Oh, what I wouldn't do for a chicken sandwich. I wish I could see what was behind me. I wish for some peace and quiet. I wish you'd leave me be. I wish for a chicken sandwich. How about not right away, okay? That's Darkness's house. Don't see why it always has to be you who reads the question. I deserve to read half of the question. It's just because I have a better... Oh, shh. It's the grand champion. Good evening, Mr. Grand Champion! Hi! Oh my gosh! Darkness must be right behind this door!
Okay, this is it. This is the big one. All right, I'm ready. Darkness, it is I, Pajama Sam. I have come to vanquish you. Hello, darkness? The closet, he's in the closet. I can't chicken out now. Got any broccoli? So what do you know, another sock? It's locked. Maybe the key for the closet door is in there. Oh no, look at all these keys. I'll never find the right one in this mess. Maybe this is the key. Nope, that's not it. Maybe this one is the right key. No, not that one. Aha! This must be the key. This key works! Okay, that's that. Now I'm ready to go into Darkness's closet and capture him! Watch out, Darkness! Here comes Pajama Sam! Darkness? It is I, Pajama Sam! I've come to vanquish you! Vanquish? Is that fun? I'm gonna capture you and lock you in my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox. Oh. oh dear, that doesn't sound like fun at all. Why would you want to put me in a box? So I won't have to be scared of you anymore? You're scared? I'm the one who's going to be stuck in the box. Oh dear, no one ever wants to come over and play fun games with me. You like to play games? Yes, but I never have anyone to play with. At night, when I come out, everybody's asleep. You mean you don't have any friends? Well, no. I like to play games. Really? Do you like to play cheese and crackers? Do I? I played it with a toaster in the park. It's great. Oh, good. We, we just need some, some, some crackers and, and some tasty cheese. Look at that move, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah? Hey, what do you know? I defeated Darkness! Ooh, I didn't see that one. You win! You're good at this, Sam. Thanks. I like this game. I better go home now, though. My mom might get worried. Okay, maybe we can play some more tomorrow night. Okay. Sam, are you all right in there? Fine, Mom. Good night. Good night, dear. <sighs> Good night, darkness.
Yeah. <laughs>